afternoon, Leo. This will be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and love. Okay, thank you and welcome back to my channel, Leo. Uh, thank you for liking, subscribing, and sharing my videos. This is Empress Bell. Okay, um, I'm here to give you guys your love, okay? So I hope these messages resonate with you guys. If you if they do not resonate with you guys, make sure you check your moon and rising sign, Leo and Venus, because this is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, Leos. See what's going on for you, Leos. So there's been a situation that's just been very stagnant, or there's been a delay in a situation. Okay, with someone, Leos. Let's see what's going on. Hmm. Mm. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. No. What's going on with Leo? Messages for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Yeah, Leo, I'm feeling like, hmm, following the five of cups, you're having a lot of regrets here after a tower moment here that you had with someone that you're not speaking to because you had the eight of wands in the reverse. The eight of wands is nothing, fast, no action, okay? There's a need to balance out a relationship or something here in love. Make an offer to a wish fulfillment or so that you can get your wishes fulfilled. Okay. Uh, 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 um. mm, you could not. You're probably not talking to a Sagittarius, but I'm feeling like uh, there's no action between the two of you. All right. Let's see what's going on currently in Leo's energy. Leo, Sun, Rising, and Venus. I love Leo. Okay. Your current energy is the Six of Wands. Okay. You could be getting a lot of attention right now. You know, recognition. You know, being put on a pedestal, okay? Because you're manifesting. You're manifesting something, okay? Maybe your dreams, your career is taking off, okay? But you're manifesting maybe moving towards someone because you finally made a decision about a situation, a home or a home situation has, has been finalized and you're going to about to move, move into your new home. So congratulations, Leo. Okay. Yeah, there was a delay due to some type of juggling, okay? Uh, maybe juggling finances, juggling two people, but there is going to be some action taken. Maybe you're going to do this on your end or someone else. Okay, could be done with a cancer. Okay, Leos, let's see. <clears throat> what else is hitting for you right now, Leo? Yeah, the, the two of swords, okay? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You're needing to make a decision and stop holding back from uh your soulmate your twin your partner king of picking and queen of pentacles someone you had a long-standing relationship with someone you were married to okay leo if you were married if you were married leo this is you're needing to make a decision about this person that you were married in or married to right now okay because you have you want a brand new beginning here okay um a brand new beginning is coming okay for you guys once you make this decision. So what's your obstacles right now, Leo? What are Leo's obstacles? Being defensive. Being on the defense. Got your guard up. You you, you know, you're having to defend yourself here to an empress. So this could be the mother of your children. Libra, Taurus, energy. You know, you're wanting to speak some truths, you know, to this person. You know, a you're having a tower moment, or you will be soon. Um, a tower moment of you actually really feeling sorry about something. You really feel sorry about uh, maybe being defensive or needing to defend yourself towards this empress. Or, you know, being having a guard up to this empress, to this, your mother or your children. Or someone that you just see as the empress. Someone that you see growth with. Someone that you see a family with. If you don't have family with this person already. Okay, or you're on the defense, just basically, maybe someone said, hey, you know, I'm pregnant, you know, and you're like, what? You know, by who? Ha! You know, Leo, I don't know. <laughs> I'm 
<laughs> you know, just had to throw that in there. But, you know, basically, you're just on the defense right now. You're defending yourself. Oh, somebody, somebody gets rumors and gossip of that you're having a baby or something like that. And you're like, what? Who the fuck told y'all that? I ain't got no damn baby. Who that ain't my baby? That bitch lying. You know, this is how Leo is coming off. This is an obstacle, okay, Leo? <laughs> what is the outcome here? What is the outcome? Three of Wands. So you're waiting for your ships to come in. You're going to wait, okay, maybe for some type of results here. You're stuck all in your head. Maybe this has happened after, you know. Ah, shit. Okay, um, I'm hearing like this may have happened after you had a one night stand with someone and then walked away. <sighs> okay. Mm, mm -mm. So if these are Leos that were in a marriage or whatever, you know, uh, you, someone walked away from you because of this one night stand that you had with someone which produced a baby. And now you're waiting maybe for the person to have the baby so that you can get some results or something like that. Uh, whereas though, you just want to know the truth, but you're just waiting for something, waiting for your ships to come in. You're waiting. We're going to figure out the hell you're waiting for, Leo. But we're going to clarify the Six of Wands. What has been illuminating you? Six of Wands definitely, since it's, you know, done changed this way. The Six of Wands is you're noticing something, okay? You're seeing somebody be a uh, up-and-coming star. You're seeing something here with the Six of Wands. Maybe you're seeing somebody being put on a pedestal, okay? Or if you're not already being put on a pedestal, because I will, why are you defensive here? And what are you waiting for? Hmm. So, you just, you know, could be getting a lot of attention right now, Leo. But is it good attention? Let's find out. <laughs> Let's say that. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, six of Wands for Leo. Something rising in Venus. Hmm. Or something was brought to your attention here. Now you need results? I don't know. Six of Wands. So... You got the ace, I mean, I'm sorry, the knight of cups at the bottom of the deck. So maybe you're wanting to apologize to a queen of wands for juggling. Or somebody wants to apologize to you for juggling. Maybe two people, two places, two ideas. Or you just want to just go in and offer a cup of love to someone here. Now, let's see what this six of wands is for Leo. Right, this, <laughs> you're noticing that you need to cut something out here with the two of swords. Two of swords twice on this board, okay? You are needing to cut some shit out here. Yep. Mm-hmm. And it's being a damn player. Stop rushing in and having one night stands with people. <laughs> because niggas is noticing that you was you being a player here. But anyway, there's a death that is about to come to. You're about to go through a transformation, Leos. Okay. Um, transformation of any kind of negative vibes or negative things or that was surrounding a marriage. Okay, yeah, you're going to move out of this rockiness with this person here. After you make this decision, the Two of Swords, what do you got to decide on? Two of Swords, you need to decide on this judgment, calling judgment on a situation here of leaving someone out in the cold, Leo. If you're leaving someone out in the cold here, um, do you need to call, there's going to be a judgment call on that, okay? Or you called a judgment call, you made a judgment call and left someone out in the cold. You did this to them or they did this to you, Okay. Yeah, you walked away from the sun, from your happiness, which is the empress, and to be single. Now things are moving slow. You're having to defend yourself and love. You know, nothing is lasting. So this was like karma. I'm feeling like you're going through type of, some type of karmic cycle on your end for not making the right judgment call. Ha! Judgment. <laughs> Clarify judgment. Clarify judgment. Yes, you didn't make the right judgment call on love. Love here. You had actual love here or you are wanting to make a resurrection or bring back a person that you actually love. You want, you're trying to figure out, because maybe you're noticing this person now. You're seeing this person. It could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Libra here with the judgment. Okay. So you know that you love this person. The Ace of, Pen the Ace of Cups. Okay. This is someone you were married to. Okay. You had a long standing relationship with, but you felt stuck. Maybe money wasn't coming in, right? Okay, so you took action and left, or this person left. Okay, oh, I don't know what's going on with that. But let's see what the Two of Swords is. What do you need to decide on to become the Emperor here? 
to, okay? Or stop being so damn controlling. Become the emperor with this person from your past, okay? Take action. The emperor, he goes after what he wants, period. And this is person that you are feeling nostalgic about, someone from your past, someone that you have children with, okay? That you know you backstabbed and betrayed and you had, you know, you had them in a third party situation because someone had options and I'm feeling like it's this emperor, which would be you, uh, Leo. So the emperor, clarify, wow, the emperor is two of cups, okay? The emperor is taking charge now on love because he sees something. See something, you might notice that this person is getting a lot of praise, a lot of recognition. You know, you're you're noticing this person now and you're wanting to come towards this Libra from your past now. Now you're wanting to make take action now for sure. You're going to, have to make this decision to take action here. The two of cups. You're secretly doing this though. Nobody knows this. Yeah, because you want to work together with this person. You like the fuck? You're not wanting to miss an opportunity and have be heartbroken forever. You miss you felt like it was a missed opportunity and your heart was broke, but you're not wanting to do that, Leos. You're going to take action here. So what's the seven of wands? Clarify the seven of wands for Leo, please. Wow. Being defensive to a new beginning here. Okay. Messages. You're maybe wanting to message someone, but you don't feel like that if you do, it's going to, you know produce anything you feel like it might start an argument more than anything okay because you know what happened when y'all left but the seven of wands is you being very defensive to this new beginning to this baby okay whatever this is you're like i don't what the fuck is this the star clarify the star um clarify the star clarify the star yeah this motherly nurture your your counterpart okay a person yeah because this person may not be talking to you right now Okay, and you're trying to figure out what can you do? What can I do? What can I do? Because the home that you guys were in was toxic. It was a very toxic relationship. So you are very defensive to any kind of new beginnings with this Queen of Pentacles. This Queen of Pentacles is very loving, nurturing, kind. She's down to earth, but you're defensive. Okay, the Queen of Pentacles. Her find the Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles for Leo. You have the three of cups, okay? You're afraid that this person doesn't want to reunite with you because of this ten of swords that you did with this person. Vice versa. Leo, you get this a lot. I don't know. Like, Leo, you're such a fixed sign that you don't make decisions. You think a lot. You think more than anything, this Leo. Yeah, because it's, it's burdening you. And you could be drinking a lot as well because of the situation. Something is imbalanced here in yourself. You're over drinking, maybe partying, but you want this re this you've been wanting this for a long time, but you are not taking any action, Leo. I don't get it. I don't get why are you so afraid to take action towards this Empress? Yes, you backstabbed and betrayed him. Yes, this is this situation ended badly, you know, but you have to take initiative you don't want to take responsibility for your own actions this is what i'm feeling leo you're afraid if you admit you were wrong everything your world will be crashing down but do you not understand the growth that will be behind that if you admit say you know what i did something wrong and i'm sorry period and really mean it but your pride is getting in the way your ego is getting in the way leo like, this is what I'm getting from this whole daring thing. Someone's pride and ego is getting in the way. And I think it's you, Leo. Because you've been saying, I want to do this. I want to do this for months with me. And my even, even on my other platforms, you've been saying this. But I'm trying to figure out what is the problem. Why aren't you taking action here? What are you afraid of? Because this is fear-based. Whatever you're afraid of, because you don't even know what's going to happen. Because you haven't even tried it. Hmm. Three of Wands. What are you waiting for? Three of Wands, Leo. What are you waiting for? <laughs> what the fuck did I just say, Leo? You're waiting to speak your truth. Listen. What is this? Per should the person from your past, this Queen of Swords? You want to tell this person, hey, I want to. Listen, Leo, do it. I swear to gosh, do it. Whatever this is, whoever this person is, do it. They're loving, nurturing, and caring. 
you know, right now they're being guided by the divine light of Archangel Michael. And they probably have had some type of spiritual awakening. So, therefore, this person is not the person you would normally talk to. Try it. I'm telling you. Just try it, Leo. And I feel like you're going to. Leos are going to. They're waiting on speaking their truth with the Ace of Swords. What's the Ace of Swords? <laughs> Four of you're holding back. <laughs> you're holding back, waiting and holding back. Wait, it's like you get a little bit. Look, look at you. Look at you. <laughs> Leo, you're holding back. It's like, all right, I'm going to do it. No, 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 I can't. Nah, never mind. I ain't even going to do it. I ain't going to do it. I ain't going to do it. <laughs> Leo, just rip the band aid off for Pete's sake. Four of Pentacles. Clarify the Four of Pentacles. <laughs> <sighs> Leo. You're holding back from this Queen of Cups. It's loving, loving your love. You're holding back or you're holding on to this person secretly wanting to start a relationship with them or something brand new, passionate, creative. But you're you're stuck. You're you're hangman and still three of freaking wands. Like you gotta be kidding me, Leo. I'm gonna need you to muster up your strength. You're the lion, remember? Roar. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys. Now, if this is somebody doing this to you, because it's like they're like playing double dutch right now. It's like one minute they want to do it. They're like, no, 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 no. I ain't even going. Well, how can I say it? Well, what can I do? I'm hearing right now somebody's going to use their children as their icebreaker. <laughs> so if you're a Leo, a Leo female or a Leo male, because, you know, fathers take care of their children as well. Shout out to the dads that take care of single fathers out there. Shout out to y'all. Okay, and um, single mother, shout out to you guys too. But this person is, <laughs> you're like, I don't know. Okay, so I'm going to use the kids on some like, you know. Yeah, the baby said. <laughs> you are something else. <laughs> Leos, you guys are amazing. Okay, you guys are amazing. Or you're going to call the person like, well, how's the baby doing? Like, So just expect that phone call from this person. Wow, Leo. Fucking wow. Forgiving and learning. This person had forgave you already, okay? They have learned from these things, okay? Now, as you release and heal your past, because you need to heal this, you're not gonna able to, you're not gonna be able to gain any new ground or footing with a new relationship if you do not fix the person from your past. Because that's just how it goes. Forgiving and learning here, okay? And it says, as you release and heal your past, you'll experience more love in your present moments. And at the bottom of the deck, reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. You are wanting this person from your past to return. All of this has to do with your past, your past, your past, your past. Okay, Leos. Okay. You want to express your love because there is a strong uh, magnetic attraction between the two of y'all because it's your darn twin flame, your soulmate for Pete's sake. This is the person you're supposed to be with. This is the person that is divinely guided to be with you. And they, our angels are working on this situation with you, Leo. So listen, those feelings of, all right, I'm going to go do it, are divinely guided answers to your questions of, should I go? I'm not sure. Yes. Yes, you should. Make that romantic gesture go because this person is going to accept you with open arms you have no I, I see this okay it's going to be a beautiful reunion if you just make up your mind okay leo this has been your reading i hope this message resonates with you guys make sure you like subscribe and um share my videos and i'll talk to you later bye